The following contest is scheduled for a football, making his way to the ring. From Austria, El Efe. Oh boy, we're in for a treat tonight. Both of these superstars look geared up and ready to go. What an entrance. This is who a large number of these fans in attendance came to see tonight. to be in amazing shape for this one, King. Well, don't let him hear you say that, Cole. That's all we need is for his ego to get even bigger. Well, for this guy's sake, it's a good thing crowd reaction has absolutely nothing to do with the outcome of the match. You're looking at a standing room only arena here in Providence, Rhode Island. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Michael Cole alongside Jerry Lawler and King. What a smackdown we have tonight. And what an opening match we have, Michael. This one's going to be an absolutely amazing contest. You said it, Michael. We're starting things off strong tonight. Happy Thanksgiving, Two. everybody. I hope you didn't fill up too much on the turkey because we got a great night planned for you. Three. And so, what are your thoughts right now on The Miz? Looking fresh right now, which is good. You got to wonder how much longer that can last, though. A wild overhead punch wreaking havoc in here. No kidding, that shot came out of nowhere. I'm not sure I can watch Five. this. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. Keep the action inside the ring. That's where you're going to win this thing. Another amazing singles contest. These two never cease to entertain the WWE Universe. Oh, out of nowhere. Oh, wait. Nice reversal. You know, it's been well documented that The Miz came from the world of reality TV. And well, it took Miz a long time to gain the respect of the WWE locker room. But he worked his way up the ladder and earned everything he has today. I gotta tell you, these guys are in the best shape I've ever seen them in. like this has become synonymous with SmackDown over the years. You know, when you talk about The Miz and his reality television career, making it tougher for him to be accepted by the locker room, you're right. Sports entertainment is a hard business to get in and stay in, and it used to be a lot tougher. But I gotta give Miz credit. He worked hard to get where he is today. The shoulders are down. One, two. He 
Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hint of weakness in the other. Well, that's a strategy you have to always have in the back of your head, Cole. If you ever see a weakness in your opponent, you got to jump on it. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. He's got him hooked. Whether The Miz is playing by the rules or having fun breaking them, WWE fans know that he is one of the best talkers in the business and can back up what he says in that ring. Actually, The Miz jumps at the opportunity to make good on his promises and display his talents. You could call this a good old-fashioned butt whooping. Yeah, that's exactly what we're witnessing, a butt whooping. Hey, the shoulders are down. And he escapes with a kick out. here. I don't know how much longer he can go. The referee may have to call this match, King. Oh, my gosh. This is awful. I'm going to tell you something. Whenever you get hit like that, for the next 15 minutes, everybody you see has an exact win. Well, The Miz certainly had built a reputation on saying what he's going to do and then going out there and doing it. The fans know it, and everyone in WWE knows it. Listen, The Miz doesn't falsely advertise. The man says he's must-see, and indeed he is. Must-see and awesome. You don't need to be an expert in the human anatomy to know that an arm is going to be in major trouble if this keeps up. Yeah, but fortunately, I am an expert Six. in the human anatomy. Seven. Not today, too fast. Back to the basics with this stretch. midsection taking a lot of damage here. I can't get over what we just saw. That was a great move. Here's the cover. One, two. These superstars looking for a victory, looking to build momentum. You're right about that. Momentum is so important in a match like this. The Miz really going to town right now. If he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly real fast. Are we going to see it? There it is, the snapmare driver delivered with authority from The Miz. Goodbye, good riddance. Yeah, The Miz has put his opponent away for good with that one. And the shoulders up. And the match continues. I love this. There's no keeping this guy down tonight. Perfectly executed. I think I know where the Miz learned that chop. Oh, the reversal by the Miz. He's looking at it. Trying to turn this around. When he gets going like this, there are a few better. He's still going, Cole. What guts? The Miz is one of the most. What a counter that was. And into the cover. Absorbing a little bit of punishment here. Nothing to be overly concerned about, though. If you're just tuning in, I'm Michael Cole. Thank you for joining us on this Tuesday evening. We're looking at complete domination here. The face is absorbing a lot of damage here. 
You know, Cole, it's become common knowledge that when Miz came into WWE, he had a run-in or two with superstars back in the locker room. But if you're going to get anywhere in this business, you have to be brash. You have to be confident. And yes, you have to think you're awesome. Boy, he just got laid out. He's pressing all the right buttons down. Is this it? Man, there's no getting up from that. Hey, this may very well be it. I'm having a hard time figuring out what they're going to do next. Me too. I've given up even the truth or consequences. The end is near. I think you're right. This one's as good as over. Two, three. He did it. What a huge win. Let's take a look at some of the big highlights. Talk about crowd pleasing. Oh, they mesmerized the WWE Universe in that match. Describe this match. Here's your winner, El Efe. Big singles win here, guys. And if that match is any indication of what to expect here tonight, we are in for one amazing evening. What a night for SmackDown. This will send shockwaves through the entire WWE. I know I'm shocked. Good night, everybody.
It's not very often you see this much star power in the ring at the same time. It reminds me of me being in the ring with me. this one ever since this match was announced. This entire building just moved. Man, you're right. That shook the arena. I remember first seeing Tamina's father, the WWE Hall of Famer Jimmy Superfly Snuka, leap from the top rope with a Superfly Splash. No one ever saw anything like it. Now Tamina's version of the Splash is one of the most impressive displays of athleticism and force in the entire WWE today. What do you think about Tamina? What hasn't been said already? Everybody's talking the unbelievable potential we're witnessing here. Let's just sit back and enjoy. I've talked to several people who think she's bitten off more than she can chew here. I can't say that I agree. One. Two. 
When Tamina Stuka climbs high and is perched Three. on the top rope, you see the Stuka family dynasty high above the ring. Tamina's version of the Superfly Splash crushes her opponent to the point where pinning her victim Four. is a mere formality. Absolutely, Michael. You can hear and feel the impact of Tamina's Superfly Four. Splash. And we have the vantage point where we can see Tamina's opponent just have the Six. wind crushed right out of their body. The impact is unbelievable. Here she goes, back in the ring now. Sends flying into the turnbuckle with a brutal Irish whip. Oh man, that landing, that sudden stop, that has to hurt. This match is being televised around the world in 18 languages and in over 110 countries. Absolutely amazing. The world is watching, and I guarantee you they're going to love it. The entire complexion of the Divas division changed in 2010 with quick pin attempt here. The shoulders are down. Two. Whoa, that was some reversal by Tamina. Today, too fast. That's what happens when you're in a powerful grasp. You go down. Oh, that slam was vicious. I have a feeling we're going to see several more demonstrations like that before the night's over. The switch here to Trish Stratus. She's back out on the apron. Uh oh. King, you mentioned earlier the impact Tamina Snuka has had on the Divas division since her 2010 WWE debut. I'll put it a different way. There's never been a more intimidating force in the Divas division than Tamina. She's laid out Diva after Diva, furthering the Snuka family legacy. Yeah, Tamina's leveled every Diva who has gotten in her way, whether she was a manager, bodyguard, or competing in a match. To say Tamina's earned a reputation of being no-nonsense is an understatement. Boy, like always, Trish Stratus showed up for this one. We're looking at complete domination here. Historically, Thanksgiving has been a big night in the sports entertainment world, and I expect tonight to be no different. You know, one of the maneuvers that Tamina has reminded the world of is the Superfly Splash and how crushing it is. The height Tamina reaches and impact to her opponent's body is simply astonishing. Oh my gosh, big time impact. They couldn't stand being in a hold like this unless she's the one applying it. Wait a minute, and she escapes the hold. Stratus doing some good work here. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. I hope you didn't fill up too much on the turkey because we got a great night planned for you. WWE Magazine out this month, and you'll find some interesting articles in there about all the superstars here in WWE. Who do you get to read the magazine to you, Cole? She's got her. Look out. She's targeting the arm now. I'm having a hard time figuring out what they're going to do next. Me too. I've given up even trying to figure out what they're going to do next. I'm just sitting back watching and enjoying. She is really putting her stamp on this match now. This might not end well. Really going to work here. Just wrenching that thing. Hang on, and she powers out. Quick 
thinking to avoid that. Oh, that was a hard shot. What a strike. Well, if that's any indication, she's not taking any prisoners in this one. No, she's on a mission here. There's the switch. Lita with the offense. She finally steps out. Well, she wants this win bad. It is so hard to stop that kind of strength. Not today. Too fast. Watch it. Watch it. It's not very often you see six superstars of this caliber competing at the same time. Lita stays on the attack. One. Quick thinking to avoid that. Two. Oh! Well, out here you have to be able to think Three. on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. She's clearly not getting paid by the hour. We're looking at complete domination here. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything Five. can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. And her partner's in a bad, bad way. Seven. This one might rest squarely on her shoulders. I've seen every episode of SmackDown over the years, and I assure you this one ranks right up there with the best. Oh, that hurt. Wait a minute. If she Will this be enough? Hang on. Two. The victory here would undoubtedly put the rest of the Divas locker room on notice. And there's the tag. She's trapped. You don't want to get in this Divas way. And there's the tag. She's hooked. Trish setting it up. With the possible exception of Stone Cold Steve Austin, I don't think anybody executes a better loot than this. Goodness. What a crafty maneuver. Can she do it? This may be it. Two. Not today. Too fast. I can tell you these Divas have been looking forward to this match for a long time. If you thought Monday Night Raw was exciting last night, just wait until you see what we have scheduled for tonight. Speaking of impressive Trish Stratus moves, her matrix almost defies the laws of gravity. The human body just isn't meant to move like that. Yeah, that move is a real testament to just how flexible Trish really is. Must be all that yoga. Going for it all here. There it is, the Uranagi. Uranagi? Wow, that was impressive. Hang on. Can she do it here? This may be it. Two. And she reaches the ropes. She's starting to put moves together. Watch out. She's on a roll. Yes. That's it. It's over. It's over. Her partner is hurt. She might have to go. Will she win it here? I think so. Two. Oh, boy. I think the referee is out of it.
You gotta love this match. It's got more curves than a racetrack. You're right. Look at all those. Uh-oh, the buzz killer. Yeah, this match ending will be a buzz killer. I love it. What diabolical things are going through that mind right now? When you get in control like this, you want to throw everything at your opponent. And that could be what we're seeing here. This is just incredible offense. Lita's one of the most ingenious divas WWE has ever seen. And Lita surprises her with a twist of fate. Man, what a move. Way to go, Lita. Cole, will she win it here? I think so. Two. And her partner's in a bad, bad way. This one might rest squarely on her shoulders. Here's the switch. Trish Stratus is in. And this union is tag team action personified. And it's Lita executing the reversal. Oh, that was a beautiful move. And it's Trish Stratus executing the reversal. This is what happens when someone wants to eradicate their opponent from... The shoulders are down! Trish Stratus is not someone to sleep on. What an all-star ensemble in the ring right now. Six of WWE's most successful competitors for sure. Uh-oh. It looks like Trish Stratus has got the momentum. I love it when Trish is on the loose. And wow, he hits it with a loop fast press. The shoulders are down. Two. We have the best job in the world getting to call matches like this. You're not kidding, Cole. Sometimes I have to pinch myself to see if I'm really here. Look out. That back was clearly part of a game plan heading in. What a display of power that was. I'm told her photo galleries are responsible for a good portion of WWE's.com's huge traffic numbers last month. You gotta love this match. It's got more curves than a racetrack. You're right. Look at all those curves. And leave it, no brakes. The back of the head taking quite a punishment here. Shoulders down. This could be it. Wow, there's the save. The match continues. Oh, what a shot. And the ref starts to go. And that's why it's called high risk, ladies and gentlemen. And there's the count. I can guarantee she's not going to like that. No kidding. Who would like that? Trish Stratus doing a great job of turning that around. Sweet. That arm is now in an extremely compromising position. Can she do it? Can she work her way out of this hold? 
Just a dominating display. Yeah, I think we could see a lot of punishment inflicted here. She's enduring a vicious attack to the back of her head. Oh, this poor demon needs... The shoulders are down! Man, she's making it look easy here. Oh, the reversal by Trish Stratus. Narrowly avoids the attack there. Look at that. You've got to believe this one's over. Going for the cover. One, two. What a punch. Ooh, the head just bounced there. And the ref starts to count. Looking at complete domination here. What a ruthless act. That is not a position you want to be in at any point in this match or ever. Now back to the ring. And here's the tag. A move like that. And here's a cover. What damage to the chest. Uh-oh. Tamina is not someone to take lightly. Tamina makes the cover. They're still alive. Yeah, Cole, you remember that song back in the day? Staying alive? Well, that was it in WWE terms. We're looking at complete domination here. Watch it. Watch it. Shining Wizard. Oh, man. You're never the same after one of those. Uh-oh. There's the finisher. This might be over. And I mean all over. The shoulders are down. Oh, and there goes the ref. The official is out of it. Just toying with the competition a little. Quick thinking to avoid that. Ah, oh, Tamina going to work now. Ow, that hurts. You gotta be kidding me. What a slam. What a ferocious slam. There's the super kick. Man, and it was right on the button. Here's the cover. the count. If you're just tuning in, I'm Michael Cole. Thank you for joining us on this Tuesday evening. She is such a professional. She knows exactly what she's doing in there. That wild strike found nothing but empty air that time. <laughs> Man, that's what you call swinging for the fences and missing. Tamina is so impressive. Look at these moves. What power. Tamina is so dominant, she can crank up the heat there anytime she well pleases. If an opponent exhibits a weakness for a specific move, some will return to utilizing that move as long as possible. Why not? If it's working, don't change it. Spells trouble right here. American Rana, it's all over now. You're right, this one's finished. Oh, look at this. No matter how you look at it, that maneuver is exciting to watch. The shoulders are down. This match is living proof that the Divas of the WWE are so much more than just a pretty smile. One, two. 
What great action we've had in this match. I'm absolutely loving it, Cole. Come on, aren't you? Look how excited you are. The snap DDT. The end is near. And the end is going to be painful. Going for the cover. Two. Not today. Too fast. And the ref starts to count. to avoid that. Oh, no! Sometimes when you go high risk, you crash and burn. And sometimes you knock it out of the park. And that was a perfect example of hitting it big. Call your friends, let them know what's going on right now in this awesome match. You're right about that. Cole, call your one friend. She just will not let up. Oh, and the reversal by Lita. That was a thing of beauty. Lita taking advantage here. She looks unbeatable tonight. And there's the tag. When she gets in attack mode, Look out. It's not very often you see six superstars of this caliber competing at the same time. like this has become synonymous with SmackDown over the years. Oh, the reversal by Trish Stratus. What a forceful attack to the back region. What authority. I think the canvas screamed in pain on the... Whoa, whoa! Cole, will she win it here? I think so. Let's see what happened during that incredible matchup.
you can feel the intensity level inside the arena rising. Willing to bet these two have absolutely no plans on spending Thanksgiving dinner together at any point in the near future. I hate Thanksgiving. A superstar gets a certain feeling when he knows there's a strong possibility he may exit the match in a completely different condition than he entered. That's not exactly a comforting thought when it's your career. Camel clutch locked in, wrenching on the neck and lower back. Mark Henry, no problem getting out of that one. Back down to earth with authority. Let me tell you, I was in the ring against Mark Henry in his first match in the WWE, and he's a monster. Every move from him can end an opponent's career, and that shouldn't shock anyone. Mark Henry's not known as the world's strongest man for nothing. Checking out Mark Henry, what can you tell us right now? You're talking about someone who has all the talent necessary to become one of the all-time greats. Historically, Thanksgiving has been a big night in the sports entertainment world, and I expect tonight to be no different. Ow! And down he goes! King, you spoke earlier about the brutality of Mark Henry's offense. We're talking about moves like the bear hug, fallaway slam, military press slam, a slew of backbreakers, and a reverse choke slam. How's that for a commitment to destroying others? Well, since you've painted such a happy picture, let's not forget Mark Henry and his more than 400-pound frame going airborne for moves like his corner splash and the big splash. Just listen to his entrance theme. It says it all. We're in the feeling out process. Who's going to get the advantage and maintain control? Your guess is as good as mine, Cole. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. I hope you didn't fill up too much on the turkey because we got a great night planned for you. The big red machine all over his opponent. All right, he missed that one. God, that's got to hurt. Yeah. You're not doing any damage with swings like that, but keep doing it. The breeze may give him a cold. He's doing everything he can to get his bearings back here. Otherwise, this match could be over sooner than anyone could have anticipated. Yeah, Cole, this is when you have to settle things down. Get the blood flowing back in your body and strategize what your next move or your next form of attack will be.
Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching SmackDown, the second longest running weekly episodic television program in history. We're seeing two outstanding athletes looking to prove their dominance in there, but only one can walk two. out victorious. Who will it be? Well, that... And he lets him out. Three. Well, he might have been losing some of his grip there anyway. He probably figured it would be better to release the hole now before his opponent could counter it. Mark Henry, no problem getting out of that one. Payne setting it up. Mark Henry, no problem getting out of that one. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. Mark Henry, no problem getting out of that one. being viciously taken down to the mat with authority. Whether Mark Henry's been a fan favorite or villain, his demeanor has never changed. The world's strongest man is mean, intense, ferocious, in a pure machine of human devastation. Well, I've said this before, and I'll say it again. Just listen to Mark Henry's theme song. That will tell you everything you need to know about the world's strongest man. Mark Henry is locked up. Using all his power to drive him to the mat. Somebody's gonna get hurt in this match. And Kane powers his way back into the match. That's called being driven straight down to the canvas. What power. No kidding, that was an awesome slam. It only takes a couple of those to bring his night to an end. For close to 20 years, Henry has been one of the most powerful forces in sports entertainment. His walk to the ring is chilling, and witnessing how he manhandles opponents is even worse. For the world's strongest man, oh, what a devastating move by Kane. The shoulders are down. Both of these competitors have so much resolve, it's going to take a minor miracle to keep one of them down. Not this! Headbutt on all fours. Mark Henry's putting this one to bed. Man, when Mark Henry crawls across the ring and hits you with that big head of his, you're out like a light. He's got the shoulders down, Cole. This could be it. When we see Mark Henry make his haunting walk to the ring, the Arnold Schwarzenegger Classic Winner's presence sends fear throughout the arena. EMTs and local medical facilities are at the ready because Mark Henry has an insane... Uh-oh, the choke slam. Uh-oh, it's right. This one's over. Into a quick cover is Kane. And the shoulder's up now. That's a kick out. Nice. What does it take to keep Mark Henry down? Mark Henry, no problem getting out of that one. And the world's strongest man catches him. Look at these two giving it their all. There's absolute. Mark Henry goes straight to the cover. Devastating. He's setting up. Oh no! Kane's got the neck. Kane scores with a tremendous move. One, a quick pin. Can he do it? Maybe. Two. Three. What a tremendous victory! There was no love lost in that match. And look at the impact in these highlights. I can't believe what we saw in that match.
Oh, they mesmerized the WWE Universe in that match. exciting SmackDown matches in recent memory. Singles action is underway, and in this one, I wouldn't attempt to predict what's going to happen. I'd just be ready for anything. Sometimes that's all you can do. People have been wanting to see these guys go at it for a long time, and by the sound of this crowd, I think they're getting what they wanted. Bad News Barrett is a merciless striker who shatters opponents' bones with clotheslines, boots, punches, knee lifts, and wasteland. It's why he calls it the Barrett Barrage. Bad News Barrett just runs through opponents. I think we got a moment here, and for The Rock, what can you tell us? Definitely looking confident in this one-on-one -on -one environment. We're going to find out who's the better competitor, that's for sure. No gimmicks here, just some good old-fashioned one-on-one action. This kind of offense he's known for. Yeah, you're right about that. He's made a name for himself with this. Two. A nice shot by The Rock. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. Three. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. 
thing, you said it earlier, and it's undeniable. Bad News Bear truly has one of the most diverse arsenals in the game. And don't forget about that big boot of his, King. Yeah, forget Five. it. When that size 14 comes at your face, you know you're in big trouble. Six. And he's heading back in. I can't blame him. Nothing good is going to happen out here on the floor. Why well, is the guy his opponent, and what's he going for here? Man, oh man, did he take a wild swing with that one. You're right. That was wild indeed. Good thing we're over here. Reversal. Barrett showing his skills. Oh, wow. to figure out a way to get to his base and break the hole. For any opponent of the Brahma Bull, it's widely known to avoid the rock bottom in people's elbow. I'd also avoid any verbal brawls that may ensue. Odds are you'll lose, get embarrassed in the process, and take your eye off the ball, which in this case is your match with one of the WWE's biggest icons. And you know, Michael, something I'd try to do as soon as possible yeah. is to go old school. I mean, isolate a body part and try to take away one of the Rock's weapons, maybe an arm or a leg, or something he gets power from for most of his maneuvers. That might be your only chance. But I'll say to whoever that person is, good luck, you're gonna need it. Bringing it back between the ropes. And that's a good thing. Six. Getting back into the ring now. King, you can take a breath. <gasps> and Michael, to add to what I was saying earlier, I'm talking about Whoa. something that's very difficult to do. Many have tried and most have failed. And that's Whoa. get the upper hand on the rock. A strategy, if you could come up with one, might be to try to keep him guessing. I mean, Chamel Clutch locked in, wrenching on the neck and lower back. Two. I guess he's done with that move. Yeah, but what's he gonna do next? Oh, wait, nice reversal. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. I can't blame him. Keep it in the ring. Six. And he's heading back in. I can't blame him. Nothing good is going to happen out here on the floor. To your point about finding a weakness and attacking, from my experience commentating, it's apparent that's the only way to go. Imagine how someone's chances would increase. He goes for the quick pin attempt. Count, Riff, count! And the shoulder's up in time. Well, as long as it's up before that three count, that's all that matters. Look at the heart of the rock! Oh, out of nowhere! The rock going for the pin. Another electric crowd on hand here for SmackDown, as has been the norm over the years. Oh no, Barrett with the opportunity. Oh, and bad news, Barrett getting on a roll here, as we're seeing if anyone in WWE. Barrett, what a crafty maneuver. Quick pin, hey, is this it? Uh, it may be. Bad news, Barrett is brash, vicious, and can't wait to let people know how he has some bad news. Barrett's a fierce competitor who will not hesitate to launch a full-scale riot in an arena in a brawl in the ring. Any way you look at it, Bad News Barrett's a heavy hitter. Yeah, well, since Bad News Barrett's been in WWE, he's been responsible for some of the most violent clashes, brawls, and battles sports entertainment has ever known. Barrett takes the upper hand here. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hint of weakness in the other. Well, that's a strategy you have to always have in the back of your head, Cole. If you ever see a weakness in your opponent, you gotta jump on it. Bad News Barrett is a bruiser who looks to immediately take control of the match. The Barrett Barrage has been witnessed all over the world. The sight of the former bare knuckle sharpshooter. The Rock sniped him, and we're done. <laughs> the Rock using the sharpshooter. That's awesome. makes the cover. One, two.
Barrett with a reversal. Oh, and a terrific reversal. One of these guys is going to walk away with the win here tonight. I just can't imagine one of them also accepting defeat. Let's talk about the biggest rivalry of The Rock. Now, there have been a lot of historic wars for the great one, but tonight, I'm going with John Cena. A showdown no one ever thought would happen. Two icons in their primes settling their differences on the grandest stage of them all, not once, but twice. And once again, Barrett gains momentum in this match. Are we gonna see it, Cole? I think so. Rock bottom! What great action we've had in this match. I'm absolutely loving it, Cole. Come on, aren't you? Look how excited you are. Oh, the rivalry between The Rock and John Cena was so unique. You can tell by how fans reacted that they knew with each interview, each standoff, they were witnessing history. The most electrifying man in all of entertainment versus the franchise of WWE. I mean, it doesn't get much more thrilling than that. Great one-on-one -on -one action here tonight. It doesn't get much better than this. Historically, Thanksgiving has been a big night in the sports entertainment world, and I expect tonight to be no different. Good Lord, that wasn't even close. So that's what it's like being so far off the mark. This is a wreck. He's moving like an uncaged animal. No lie, he's wild in there. Oh, out here you have to be able to think on... I don't believe the destruction oh. we're seeing. This guy's just going from one painful move to another. Look at Barrett here. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, Six. concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. Seven. He's too good inside the ring to be out on the floor for long. I don't agree with you, King. And Barrett nails it. Now that's a finishing move. This thing might be... And this has got to be it. I think so. Two, three. What a huge win. You want to talk about crowd-pleasing? Describe this match. We may be looking at the match of the year. such a success. Thank you so much for joining us. The following tag team contest is 
scheduled for one fall on the wing of the ring from Luzerne, Switzerland, weighing in at 232 pounds, Cesaro. Oh, the referee will undoubtedly have his hands full when these two teams collide. You'd be hard pressed to find a better tag team match than we're about to see here. And his tag team partner from Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, the world heavyweight champion, Finn Balor. Man, both of these teams are determined to walk away with a win. Something's got to give. It doesn't get much more exciting than these teams set to square off here tonight. of these two competitors looks nearly unstoppable. There's no denying that this is a tremendous tag team combination. It reminds me of the old APA.
This match is officially underway, and we're going to see exactly what the Big Show can do. Oh, uh, Michael, this is going to be fun to watch. One. Two. These guys giving this sold-out crowd exactly what they came to see. What Three. an incredible match. Cesaro has found an answer here. And if you're looking for a superstar who's made a major impact in WWE pay-per-views in his career, look no further than Big Show. I think back especially to his epic year in 2011 when he had unreal Six. battles with Mark Henry at the year's biggest events. Survivor Series, Money in the Bank, Vengeance, Seven. all of them featured Big Show and the world's strongest man getting after it. So give us the breakdown here on the Big Show. Here's somebody who's willing to do just about anything to get to the top. I like it. That's the way it should be. This match is being televised around the world in 18 languages and in over 110 countries. Absolutely amazing. The world is watching, and I guarantee you they're going to love it. One of those matches you brought up, Cole, at Vengeance 2011, contained one of the craziest moments we've ever seen at a pay-per-view. Big Show's half-ton superplex on Mark Henry that caused the entire ring to implode. That was just pure crazy. I don't think we'll ever witness anything like that again. Covers. One, two. Not today, too fast. Quick thinking to avoid that. He gets the tag. And now he's back out on the apron. He's in big trouble. The ring collapsing at Vengeance under Show and Mark Henry. Those are the kind of moments you get when the world's largest athlete has a championship dangled in front of him. And Big Show finally did get that heavyweight title from Henry later that year. And look at to catch him off guard. Quick round Two. count. Look at Finn Balor here. Uh-oh. Climbing the turnbuckle. He is slowly getting dissected. Watch out! Look at this energy from Finn Balor. Look at these moves. This is awesome. I don't know how he does it. I've been in the business a long time, and I haven't seen anyone with the energy and ability of Finn Balor. Watch it! That's it. That's got to be it. Finn Balor. Now that's a finishing move, people. I'll never forget. I was ringside the night Big Show made his debut at the St. Valentine's Day Massacre in 1999. Hoping it ended early. Here's hoping. No, oh, wait. Nice reversal. It's nearly impossible to deal with this type of power. Yep, there's the reversal by Finn Balor. And he might have to do this by himself. His partner doesn't have much left. Hang on. Big Show had a little bit of a different look when he made his debut at the Saint. The coup de gras is going to be the coup de gras. Does the coup de gras mean this thing's over? Two. And there's the count. Here we go. Back inside the ring. What do you mean we? We're still outside the ring. Cole, it's them. They're inside the ring. Signs of letting up. Here come by. Well, it'll take a minor miracle to come back from this. Makes the cover. One, two. Work is being put in by Big Show. 
You know, King, in addition to being a WWE superstar, Big Show has quite a few movie and TV show appearances on his resume. He's carving out a pretty nice career for himself on the side out there in Hollywood. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. He's just getting dissected. Finn Balor is in position. Finn Balor scores with a tremendous move. Finn Balor making his statement as we speak. It is so hard to stop that kind of scoring for the cover. One, two. A knockdown drag out brawl complete with a big stop. Man, these guys are throwing bombs. They're pulling out all the stops. Now that's how you make a statement. What a finishing move. This could be it right here. He's not going to beat you with that move, but he's going to make sure you feel it. Looking for all the glory here. Two. The referee getting involved now. And the ref starts to count. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. There's the big boot. Big Show escapes that one. Yeah, cat-like quickness out of the world's largest athlete. There's a line I never thought I'd say. One. And there's the tag, and he has to make a tag to his fresh partner. Just brings him down to the mat with authority there. I don't like how slow he is to react right now. We're looking at complete domination here. So far, this has been a very competitive tag team match. Yeah, these are two top-tier teams. I wouldn't expect anything less from them. My God, his body's been through. Taker with the cover. Two. Hey, that's how you do it. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching SmackDown, the second longest running weekly episodic television program in history. Not today, too fast. Oh, this will bring everybody. What an insane move by Cesaro. He goes for the quick pin attempt. Count, Rich, count. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. I hope you didn't fill up too much on the turkey because we got a great night planned for you. Finn Balor tags in. Oh, out of nowhere! Why is the guy his opponent and what's he going for here? This. When you're such a prolific striker like The Undertaker, you can create your own momentum. Three. When you're as dominant as The Undertaker, you can unleash the flames of hell at your choosing. This is dangerous. Oh, The Undertaker is a force within the ring. Finn Balor, totally vulnerable at this point. He makes the tag.
Look out. Finn Balor going high risk. When this guy's on, look out. Wait, is he still conscious? Man, that looked bad. Hey, he's going for it again. Oh, that's it. That's got to be it. Finn Balor. Now, that's a finishing move, people. It's nearly a... The shoulders are down. Two. Three. Well, you were right about Big Show. They did it. They won the match. I can't believe what we saw in that match. team match and this one was unforgettable i mean these teams gave us everything they had and the wwe universe is the true winner in this one and don't forget you and i we have the best seats in the house i have a feeling they're going to be talking about this win for a while as hard as it will be not to think about that amazing match we just saw we must move on here guys